Um, any soap would work. I use this. So the ratio is about one to four. It's working already. Oh, it's right quite smooth. Okay, stop. product it's a touch-free soap dispenser uh, so no more of this okay we don't need this anymore so let's switch to this uh, if you look in the back there's a off on and chime uh, buttons that you can turn on to whatever you like uh, because I know when you put it on it doesn't make any uh, sounds or any chime but if you turn it to a chime position uh, it's, it's, it's gonna play some music so like that uh, to me I don't I don't really like that uh, sound so but it's it's an option. It's good to have the more feature the better. Uh, so I'm just gonna turn it to on position, and this is very easy to open. Okay, just twist it a little. So let's ditch this guy. And go with this guy. How about that? I spill a little. Oops. So you can see it's it's working. <laughs> uh, awesome. Yeah, I don't want to spill it anymore. So let it drip. I'm going to pause the video. And then we'll come back. Okay, so it looks like we have uh, more than halfway there. There's a max line right here. Uh, you don't want to go over too much. So, 
let me tell you that it's working. Okay, see that? Wash my hands. This is gonna go into my bathroom. So uh, I'm not gonna leave it here in the kitchen. But for the video purposes. I have to bring it down here. My uh, bathroom is a little small. So the only thing, you know, that's they might have to switch this on the side or something. It's easier to reach instead of, you know, lift it up. And you might spill things. Okay, so it's off now. Uh, I like the design. It looks nice. Uh, nothing wrong with that. Uh, the clear case in the back. Uh, tell you, you know, how much you have left. The only thing though, it uses uh, batteries. Four AAA batteries. So, might, you know, if they can uh, upgrade it, make it uh, USB. Uh, rechargeable or something that would be a lot better but otherwise it's still a good product i like it uh very convenient okay so that's all i have